Hello and welcome to Shada Cook. Our today's recipe is Chinese dosa. It is getting very popular nowadays and it is basically a Chinese twist to your Indian dosa. It tastes really really good. It forms a bulk of noodles and vegetables. So let us start. So we are going to start with the filling. We have took about half cup of capsicum. To that we are going to add half cup of cabbage and you can see we have um cut all the vegetables and julienes and next we are adding onion here we have took about half cup of onion half cup of carrot you have took all vegetables of half cup and lastly we are adding noodles we have took hakka noodles and we have boiled them and we have added just a pinch of turmeric for color but it's optional okay so next we are adding about 1 and 1/2 teaspoon of shezwan sauce it is very easily available in the market or we also have a video on how to make shezwan sauce at home you can check it on our channel shada cook or i will also link it down in the description box 1 teaspoon of red chili sauce 1/2 teaspoon of soya sauce and 1/4 teaspoon of salt because all sauce also has the salt and now we are going to mix everything well so filling is ready and here we have took dosa batter okay so over here we have took a dosa tawa so we are going to start by heating our tawa it should be very hot so once it gets very hot we are going to lower the flame and then we are going to sprinkle water and wipe it with tissue or a cloth this way uh, a normal temperature of the tawa is maintained okay so we are going to start by spreading our dosa batter make sure to keep your batter a little thicker because we are going to put the vegetables on the top and we want our vegetables to be cooked properly to that we are going to add butter and just spread the butter all over so that it gets your batter gets cooked properly and it also gives a very nice crispiness and a nice flavor okay so we are moving our spatula just in this way so that the batter gets even and our butter spreads properly all over so next we are going to be putting our filling on the top we are adding about 2 teaspoons of tomato ketchup but this is optional but it gives a very nice flavor you can use it when you're giving it to your kids and we are adding butter and now we are going to just mix the sauce and the filling together and now we are going to cover it and let it cook for about a minute and make sure you keep it on low flame so that your batter down does not gets burned okay so it's been a minute and it's all butter on the top and now we are just spreading the vegetables all over so we have spreaded it all over and you can see our dosa batter has got nice and brown on the corners so now we are just going to fold the dosa and you can see it came out with such a precision and it has got a very nice brown color so there we go our chinese dosa is ready and you can see the vegetables in the nice and juicy and crunchy and really tasty and our dosa on the top is also nice and crispy it has a very nice chinese taste so do try it it's very simple to make Hello everyone. Welcome to Shada Cook. Today we are going to make a very simple dessert that is grilled chocolate sandwich. All you need for this is butter, dark chocolate and bread slices. Okay, so first we are going to start by applying butter on both these slices. Next, we are going to put a nice layer of chocolate and now the other slice on the top. That's it. Now we are going to apply just a little bit of butter on the top. On the grill. So keep it on the grill for about 3 to 4 minutes until as crispy you want it. So it's done. And 
can just sprinkle my icing sugar on the top there you go your chocolate grilled chocolate sandwich is ready and you can see it's nice and crispy plus you can see the layer of the chocolate and you can just serve it with ice cream and strawberries if you like this video do thumbs up and subscribe thank you so much for watching bye bye